Hey YouTube, we are trying La Strada Grill for the first time ever here on Carnival Venezia. I'm gonna post some pictures of the menu and I'm going to get a bunch of different food options to tell you what I think. Uh, excited to try this brand new food venue here, exclusively on Carnival Venezia. So I brought my La Strada Grill down to the main atrium, down on deck four. I figured this would be a great place to check out all of the new items. I'll put pictures of the menu and each of the descriptions in the post, but wanted to really take a first look on at this new restaurant. It's the second new venue introduced on the Venezia. First was Il Viaggio. You saw that video here. Now, uh, Italian street food is at La Strada Grill. It's only available on sea days. They've got a variety of sandwiches. Interesting, they've got uh, the guys, uh, guys Pig and Anchor or Old Fashioned Barbecue, depending on the ship that you're on. They've got the classic mac and cheese. They've got some of the pulled meats, but they're very um, sandwich, hero forward. They've got this amazing looking garlic bread. Does that not look good? Sausage, new potatoes, quinoa some hoagies or heroes, mac and cheese. The mac and cheese looks like standard. And they've got a variety of sauces as well, just like uh, Pig and Anchor, they've got a variety of sauces. They've got some aiolis and some spicy ones. Hmm, ranch based. Mmm, mmm, that red one is really good. I bet you with the mac and cheese dunk nail It's a standard mac and cheese. I know a lot of people love uh, the pig and anchor slash old fashioned barbecue mac and cheese. I think it's just okay. Here's a cruise tip. I always dunk it in the pig and anchor sauce or the, or the Guy Fieri sauce that they have at those venues. Then it's amazing. That uh, brown sugar bacon. And this ship doesn't have those because they they favor more of the Italian aiolis and items like that. So let's go ahead and take a look at the beef hero. As you can see, there's some salami in there, there's some roast beef, there's some cheese. I'm not, maybe onion? Let's, let's go ahead and give it a bite. And it's pretty darn tasty. It is pretty darn tasty. Tons of flavor, uh, a little salty. The, the meats make it a little salty, but it's a really good flavor. Mmm. I don't know if you could hear that crunch, but that bread, the baguette, is awesome. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Okay, so a little change of venue to finish up uh, the first ever lunch at uh, La Strada Grill. They started cranking music in the atrium, unfortunately, and I just couldn't record. I know I'd started with the, the beef uh, slider, delicious. I, I really like it. The, the bread is amazing. The baguette is amazing. I'm going to try the, which one is this? Ooh, the chicken slider, Sicilian chicken slider. Looks really tasty. Mmm, mmm. It's really saucy. It's got that same baguette, that same crunch. I don't know if you can pick up on that crunch. Really good. Mmm, I really like it. Let me try it again. It's a little messy. Mmm. <laughs> I was gonna tell you that I like the beef one better, but I, I mean, I, I really like the beef one, but this chicken one has all sorts of peppers and sauces and maybe a little, and cheeses. It's so good. Mmm. Okay, my first two bites at La Strada Grill. Well, I had the mac and cheese, but that, that didn't count. My first two sandwiches at La Strada Grill, absolutely highly recommend. And also, they've got some of the, what looks to be guys old uh, beef up there, but they've added some peppers to it to make it Italian. So thank you, Carnival. Um, I can't get any of the peppers. They are, the meal is served on the uh, Pig and Anchor silver trays. So if you've sailed Carnival, you know those trays. Let me take a bite. Mmm. Mmm. Mm-hmm. 
the meat is super flavorful. Wow. I actually think this is better. I don't know if it's because it's cooked in the peppers. I think this is better than, well, I don't know if I can say that. Mmm. Mmm, I do. I actually think this is better than old fashioned barbecue. I hope no one judges me out there if that's a big favorite of yours, but it is really, really tasty. That beef with those peppers. They also have a full length bratwurst that they serve up there. So it, this is also doused in some peppers. It's doused in some, what looks to be marinara. Oh my gosh. Y'all, oh, there's so much flavor in that sausage. Let me show you. There is so much flavor in that sausage. I'm gonna take a bite of the garlic bread. It, it looks just kinda, maybe I'm just hungry, but even the garlic bread, see that toastedness on there? It tastes just like it came off of a grill. It tastes like it came off of a barbecue, buttery, grilled. Mmm. I'm gonna try the new potato salad. It looks like the old potato salad, but it's got some peppers in it. So uh, and they call it the new potato salad. And that's the first bite that I've had. I mean, outside of the mac and cheese. First bite that I've had that is just okay. It's, um, mm, that's better. It tastes almost like watermelon. I'll have to look at the menu and see what I'll, I'll, Well, that was a lemon rind that I, um, YouTube, the things that I eat for you. Okay, the new potato salad was not my favorite. Lastly, I'm gonna try the quinoa, which has these chickpeas in it, and I love chickpeas. Y'all, so if you don't know about it, Carnival Venezia has a brand new venue called La Strada Grill, only open on sea days. It is outside, aft, starboard on deck five. I'm gonna put the deck plan right here. And it is a winner. It is absolute winner. I've eaten all of this food without any sauces. And so for, for you all know, I love my sauces. I like to dunk, I like to dip, I like, I love sauces. Outside of the mac and cheese and maybe the new potato salad, there was nothing on this plate that needed a sauce. Not a single thing. That is how good this meal is. Now, La Strada Grill, brand new. So maybe the, maybe the quality will change over time. I hope not. I hope to see this quality continue. I'm gonna take another bite of this beef sandwich just to make sure it's still that it was my favorite. Mm -hmm. I want you to try this food so badly. It is so good as I eat here in my stateroom and make a mess. I mean, truly, Italian street food. Now we know what's at La Strada Grill. We've got the full menu. I've tried almost every single thing on that menu. I missed the corn. There was some corn as well you'll see in this picture. I missed a couple of minor things. And honestly, I tried the sauces. Both of the sauces were really good, really like them. But, oh, let's do that. Let's dunk a potato in one of these sauces and see if that makes the new potato salad better. Look at that orange. It's the spicy one. Mm-mm, mm-mm, nope, mm-mm. Don't mix the potato salad with the sauces. It just has a, they start to fight, the flavors start to fight together. Don't, don't do that. No, let's, let's try some more of the quinoa that I really like. Okay, order that I would rate the food. I would rate the the beef, that beef sandwich with uh, what's with the, with that beef and with the um, salami and the sauce. I would rate that and this crunchy bread with the cheese and the slaw. I don't know if you can see that cheese and slaw and onions. That is my favorite. Probably followed by the chicken. Probably followed by that beef with vegetables. 
the brat, then the quinoa, then the potato salad, then the mac and cheese, probably in that order. Oh, and the garlic bread is delicious with the grill marks. Like, it's all good. That is what I will tell you. Sorry, this was way longer than I intended it to be. I was just gonna give you a quick update on the food at La Strada Grill, but I was blown away. I can't wait to hear your thoughts. Post it down below in the comments. If you try La Strada Grill or if you've tried it, let me know what you think. What did you get? Did you like it? Is the menu still the same? And I will keep you posted if it changes throughout the rest of the sailing. We've got, we've got a few more sea days to go. We'll see you soon. Okay, so don't judge, but it's true. I liked it so much <laughs> that I came back for more. Here with Jason, introducing him for the first time to La Strada Grill. I got new things this time, the baked beans. They are like a mozza, or, yeah, mozzarella marinara baked bean. I've never had anything quite like it. Mmm. Mm, mm -hmm, mm. I also got the corn, the buttered corn, because I figured I'd had almost everything else. It's just undercooked corn. It's just... Yeah, I wouldn't um, maybe pass on the corn. They also have interesting, these grilled grilled veggies, grilled onions, um, squash. Mm. I mean, if you want to add a little bit of health to your La Strada Grill experience, I guess you could get a piece of grilled squash. It's fine. I'm going back to these beans. Mmm. Mmm. Mmm, yes. It's true, I like the pulled pulled meat so much that I got another helping as well as my favorite. Oh, I guess you can't really see it. This Italian hoagie, this beef hoagie, truly my favorite thing here. Mmm. Got two new sauces, the marinara. I don't know what I would put the marinara on, so I'm skipping that. And it's not very marinara, it's kind of gross. Um, and the aioli, it's good. I just don't know what I'm putting an aioli on. I mean, maybe the hoagie, the garlic bread? Overall, if you haven't picked it up yet, my impressions on La Strada Grill, awesome. Highly recommend it here on board, only on board, Carnival Venezia. Bye, off to enjoy some more food.